Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, sir. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Welcome. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, welcome. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, good evening.
Okay, uh, let me share the topic that we have for today. This is section number 17. And the topic for today is how to use be going to. So we are going to talk about that. But first of all, I would like to talk about something else. Okay, I, I'm going to tell you this in Spanish. Me gustaría que hubiesen estado todos y quizás voy a hacer como una espera. He estado revisando las notas y eh, me aparecen varios que eh, solamente me han trabajado la semana uno. Y recuerden que ya estamos justamente en la semana 4. Es necesario que vayan trabajando despacio para que al final no nos toque correr. Porque en mi caso, si yo termino módulo hoy, yo entrego notas el día siguiente antes de las 8 de la mañana. Entonces, esa es mi, 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 mi costumbre, ¿no? Entonces... Será bien difícil eh, después de finalizar el módulo estarle recordando eh, que usted esté corriendo con esas actividades. Es por eso que yo siempre les he venido eh, indicando, preguntando si hay algún problema referente a cómo ingresar a la plataforma. Pero, eh, pues, por el momento todos están, pero que no han completado. Incluso estoy viendo el midterm exam, que también uh, solamente tengo registro de, ya les digo. Tengo registro de 14. Es decir, me faltan seis todavía que no han hecho el midterm examen. Y ese fue de la semana anterior. Entonces, suplicarles, pedirles que hagan un tiempo ahí para poder resolver las actividades. Y que justamente el día que finalicemos, ese día, eh, ustedes ya tengan completo todo su todas sus actividades. Bueno, me tomé estos minutos para incentivarles. Todavía sí se puede. Hay que eh, volar en esto, sí. Para quienes no han completado, a quienes ya completaron sus tres semanas, estamos muy bien. Al menos hasta la hora que yo revisé, que fue ahí por las cinco de la mañana, 4 y 30 de la mañana, pues todavía tenía ahí algunos espacios en blanco, pero posiblemente alguien los haya completado durante el día, eso espero. So, uh, let us switch in English. Uh, we are going to continue, as I told you, this is class number 17, and I already showed you the topic. But before to start, I would like to know, What do you remember about the previous class? Just let me let me know uh, and share with the class. What do you remember about? And that way we are going to activate our previous knowledge. Okay, let us know what do you remember about? Hola, hola, hola. Just tell me if you can hear me very well, because sometimes I, I think that I'm doing my best about microphone, but sometimes I got problem with that. That is the reason why at the beginning of the class, I say hello to everyone in order that you can uh, You can use your microphone and that way you are going to be really uh, 
that you'd be pretty sure that your microphone is working properly. So uh, let us start now talking about the topic. Okay, I, I, I want to welcome to Gabriela, America, Sara Lopez, Natalia, Gisela, Roxana, Erwin, Cecilia, Janet is here, Hector, eh, Mercedes, Jonathan, eh, Sergio, Carlos, and Paola. Okay, thank you very much uh, to be here with me. We are uh, in the last week in order to finish this module. So I invite you to participate in order that you can get familiar with the knowledge. No me voy a cansar de pedirles que participen durante las clases porque sé que esa es una de las actividades a través de las cuales uno puede desarrollar las habilidades del idioma. Entonces, eh, pues yo siempre voy a estar ahí llamándoles. Algunas veces eh, en forma directa, algo otras veces llamando que participen de forma voluntaria. Pero ahí voy a estar siempre, hasta el último día, invitándoles a que participen. So, uh, let me check out the, the attendance and then we are going to start with the topic. Okay. But first of all, tell me, how do you feel today? Just let me know. How do you feel? In my case, I've been working a lot in two different places. I had to travel to, as soon as I finished in one place, I had to move to another one. And I had to travel about 20 kilometers in order to get to the, my another job. But I enjoy what I do, you know. So I feel pretty good today and ready to start uh, and share with you uh, all that we have prepared for you. Okay, let me know what, what do you think about. Okay, America, are you there? Present teacher, good evening. Oh, okay, good evening. Carlos Amilcar. Present teacher. Okay, thank you, sir. Uh, Cecilia Maribel. Present. Okay, gracias. Edwin Alexis. Edwin Alfredo. Present, good evening, teacher. Okay, good evening. Esmeralda El Rosario. Gabriela Jamilet. Present teacher. Okay. Eh, Gisela Guadalupe Martinez. Present teacher. Okay, perfect. Uh, Héctor Enrique Santa Maria. Present teacher. Okay. Ingrid Geraldina Calderón. Ingrid Geraldina Calderón. Jonathan Stanley Perez. Present teacher. Okay. Don Jose Ernesto Alemán Garcia. Catherine Paola Jovel Rivas. Present teacher. Okay. Candy Natalia Sanchez. Present teacher. Eh, Mauricio Antonio Rivera. Mercedes Alejandra Rivas. Present teacher. Okay, Mercedes. Roxana Álvarez. Present teacher. Okay, Roxana Elizabeth Landa Verde. <coughs> Sara Alejandra López. Present teacher. Okay, Sergio Adolfo Hernández. Present teacher. Okay, Janet del Carmen Campos. Present teacher. And Yesenia Lisette 
Aguilera Cruz. It's not here, Jessani. Bueno. Okay, let us continue then. At the end, I'm going to talk about uh, the activities in the platform. Cuando ya estén la mayoría, vamos a, a volver a hablar sobre las actividades de la plataforma. Recuérdense que eso es eh, parte fundamental para la promoción del siguiente módulo, así como su asistencia también. So I invite you to complete it. Okay, let us start now. Welcome to everyone again. And here we go now, okay. Okay, we want to start with these questions. I, I, I know that I asked you a question related with the previous top, topic that we started yesterday, but we are going to relate this one with the previous one too. So uh, let us start. We have a question here. Do you prefer to stay in modern or antique hotel when you travel? Do you usually make your hotel reservation or someone else does it for you? Okay, tell me. Teacher, I think so is is better staying mother hotel. But I never uh, was staying in in a hotel. Really? No, teacher. Never. Okay. Nice. Okay. Thank you. Okay, don't forget the question. Do you prefer to stay in a modern or antique hotel when you travel? Do you usually make your hotel reservation or someone else does it for you? But in your case, Gabriela, you said that never, that means that you are not going to answer the second question. That is the reason why you are not going to answer it. Okay, someone else wants to answer this question, please. Me, teacher. Okay, don't Edwin. <clears throat> okay, I, in my case, I prefer to stay in modern hotel okay. because for me is a lot of um, accommodation, amenities is, okay. is better for me. And usually um, reservation is not, is not usually, is when my for my job i i was uh travel to other countries okay but for me it's not not no more usually is one time um a year or, or two years maybe okay okay mm -hmm. okay thank you sir you're welcome okay someone else someone else please For me, teacher, uh, it's the pen. Um, uh, I I went uh, to Antigua, Guatemala, and antique hotels is are is are beautiful. And and the second question, the uh, hotel reservation uh, are made by the company. Okay. Yes. Your company uh, deal with that situation, okay. That That's means true. that someone else, someone else does it for you, okay? They just give you the ticket and say, okay, here is your ticket. 
and you are going to stay in this hotel. So please stay there at this time and you are going to live at this time and so on. Okay, okay, perfect. Okay, thank you. Someone else want to talk about this? Me teacher? Okay. Don't, don't. I prefer uh, stay in mother hotel teacher. Okay. It's nice, but it's very expensive for me to share. In, in my auction, <laughs> I I prefer to stay in a antique hotel teacher with my family. Okay. And the second question, do you usually make your hotel reservation or someone else does it for you? Antique, antique. Hola, 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 hola. Hello, hello, hello. Are you there? Oh, teacher, hello. Yes, yes. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, someone else, someone else. The, pro the, pronunci the pronunciation is antique or antique. Antique. Ant antique. Antique. Antique, okay, thank you. Not tique. Ant antique, antique. Okay, someone else wants to answer the question? No? Or oh, yes, just let me know. Do you prefer to stay in other or antique hotel when you travel? Share your experience with us, please. What can you tell us? Hello. Okay, let me see. Okay, we got sixteen. We are missing six. Six. Okay. Okay. Someone else wants to answer the question? No? Okay, let me ask, let me ask then if you don't want to. Okay, let me see who's going to be a teacher. It's raining a lot here and I don't hear much. Okay, I recommend you to use a handset in order that you can hit it in the right way. You need to have one of uh, something like this. Let me show you here. Okay, you need one of these in order to hear very well. When it is raining, it's necessary to put it on. And it helps a lot. Okay, let me see. So, someone else wants to talk about, no? Teacher. Hello, sir. Um, in my case, it's uh, difficult for me to speak English, but I try, teacher. And I appreciate it. And, uh, and uh, my answer for second question, teacher. Um, in my case, um uh, my co-worker made a reservation for a training quizás por para entrenamientos o consult o consultorios creo que se puede decir dicho 
consultorías. Correcto. Pero lo hacen mis compañeros. No, yo nunca he hecho una reservación. Ah, ok. But maybe some, someone is insured in order to do that. That is the yes, reason why. In, uh, in your job, maybe in your company, your, your company has uh, someone insured in order to do that, that situation. That is the reason why. Ok, thank you. Uh, lo que dice don Jonathan es muy importante. Eh, ya que, bueno, él es uno de los que está siempre activo, esforzándose para participar. Eh, felicito a todos los que lo hacen y a quienes no, también invitarles a que sí lo hagan. Y bueno, todos tienen la oportunidad de poder eh, hacerlo sin ningún temor. Para eso es la clase. And as you can see, uh, I try to speak only English, but suddenly I need to explain a little bit something in Spanish. But uh, during the process, uh, we are going to reach a level that we are going just to speak English, not Spanish at all. So I invite you to participate. And that way you are going to interact with each other. You are going to share what you are thinking about. So uh, let us do it now, please. Ahí está Gaby. Mire, Gaby siempre, ella siempre está activa participando también. Entonces alguien no me puede decir, ah, no, teacher, es que usted solamente con él. No, no, no. I try to give the opportunity to all of you. But if you don't answer when I call, it's another issue, right? So let us continue then. I know that all of you are able to do it. Teacher. Hello, sir. Uh, maybe the other partners has a lot of uh, um, the worries, uh, fear. <laughs> fear and but it's necessary to speak in, in English in yes. class. But only, uh, no, no fear, no fear. <laughs> no. Ma may maybe, maybe for... for they, they, they don't trust in themselves. Yes, uh, maybe think that uh, mistakes in um, the time of speak. Yes, what I need is that all of you we have uh, confidence with you in order that you can start speaking in English. Uh, it's don't necessary. Worry. Don't, don't, don't it's, necess it's necessary. Really, really necessary. If you never do it, ooh, it's going to be difficult for you to develop the language. So, in my case, I consider speaking one of the most important skills in a language. So, I invite you to do it. Practice. Did you? Pra Practice made perfect. Okay. My ideas are short to share. And I fear having mistake. Mm, yeah, the problem is that all the time you are uh, taking care of us then. But according to the natural uh, approach, that means that we are going to start speaking English. No matter of not taking care of our grammar. Of course, right here, sometimes we study some grammar point in order that you can have more ideas uh, about. But at the same time, what we want is that you start doing your best in the language. That is the main point. So uh, that is the reason why I create the environment in order that all of you speak in English. As you can see, as soon as I open the platform, I say, good evening, welcome, how do you feel today? And I start using the language. 
But suddenly I, I can make an stop when I need to explain something that maybe is uh, so special and I don't wonder that you have any doubt about, for example, talking about race and activities. But uh, I know that all of you can do it. So let us start today. This is the last week. Y en español yo siempre les digo a mis estudiantes al final del ciclo, a cada uno. Les digo, ok, finalizamos ciclo, solo necesito lo siguiente. Sí. Y comienzo en la lista, fulano. Dígame qué se lleva, qué aprendió durante todo el semestre. Ah, ok. Y comienzan ellos algunos a hacer un sumario y a decir, ah, mire, aprendí esto, aprendí esto, aprendí esto. Pero también tengo otros que ellos mismos dicen, no, mire, bien sabe, fíjese que la verdad es que siempre venía tarde por X o Y. Y pues yo ahí iba tratando de ir pasando, pero no he agarrado mucho y, you know. Pero ya ellos son, son jóvenes que los papás le dan todo. En cambio aquí es diferente. So uh, every time that I ask you to talk about a uh, review about a previous topic, you need to have an idea because you you have uh, your notes with you and you can take a look at that and you can start talking about. So we are giving you the opportunity to develop your skill with us. Por lo tanto, como inglés corporativo, estamos siempre eh, pensando en darle la oportunidad a usted de que hable para que pueda desarrollar el idioma. Ahora ya resta de usted si usted dice, no, es que mire, bueno, diferente. Aspect. Ok, pero talking about, speak, let, let us uh, share an activity and you are going to talk about. Ahí veamos, sí, 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 vamos a hablar, veamos. Ok, let me share it. Ok, I got a wheel here and I'm going to... I'm going to clip here in order that uh, can can move, and you are going. Uh, but first of all, I'm going to shoot someone. Okay, in this case, let me see who is going. The person that is going to give me an answer. Let me see who is going to be. Okay, what about you, Janet Campos? Are you there? Say hello, please. Hello, sir. Okay, here we go. Okay, let us talk. Read the question and answer it, please. Lea la pregunta, por favor, y la responde. Ingrid, Ingrid. What are you going to tomorrow? Okay, answer the question. Answer the question, please. Tomorrow it's my day off. Okay. What are you going to do? I don't know. <laughs> no idea as well. Okay, don't worry, don't worry. Okay, choose someone from, from the from the platform, please. Elija alguien más por favor, Ingrid. Gabriela. Okay, Gabby, are you there, Gabby? 
Yes, teacher. Here we go. Voy a contestar. Okay, read the question, please. And answer it. Are you going to travel this year? And the answer is not. I don't go to travel this year. Oh, sería go, teacher. Ojo, ojo, ojo con eso. Ojo con Ajá, eso. este. La pregunta dice. Porque, are bueno, ¿qué ves? Are you going to travel? I don't, yo no estaré. Ajá. Okay, ¿Cómo sería? I am. Uh... I don't going to travel this year. Será así? Será que vamos a usar <laughs> el don o cuál vamos a usar? We started that mm. previous uh much of Teacher sería, I am not going to travel. Ah, okay. Okay, I am not going to travel to any place. Okay. Okay, perfect. Choose a, a name, choose a name, please. Elija un nombre, por favor. Edwin. Hello, Erwin. Present, present. Hello. Okay, here we go. Okay, read the question um, and answer it, please. Okay, the question is, are robots going to replace people? For me, never, because it's not natural. And, and they never can be replaced the people okay okay we respect your point of view okay give me, give me a name we respect your point of view Nosotros okay lo respetamos su punto de vista. okay thank you okay um, uh, uh, give me a name please name name uh Carlos Amilcar. Carlos. Hello, Carlos. Hi, teacher. Hello. Okay, read the question, please. Read the question. What are you going to cook, um, to cook next time? Uh, okay. I think in tomorrow, uh, in the breakfast, I I think a uh, uh, eggs uh, with platanos. No estoy seguro cómo se dice. <laughs> okay. And and beans. And beans. Okay. Okay. Don't worry about. It. Don't worry about. It. Okay, thank you. Give me a name, please. Uh, Sergio. Okay, here you go, Sergio. Sergio. Uh, I'm not going uh, uh, watch Insters in today. I going to sleep to finish. Okay. Yes. Give me a name, please. Um, Cecilia. 
Ceci, are you there, Ceci? I am here. Okay, here we go. Okay, good. Uh, very interesting question. Just read it and answer it, please. No la comprendo, teacher. De veras? What do you think the weather is going to be tomorrow? ¿Qué piensa? ¿Cómo cree, cómo piensa usted que estará el clima mañana? Raining. Okay. Thank you. Give me a name, please. Uh, Ingrid. Okay, Ingrid. Are you there, Ingrid? Yeah. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Okay. Are you going to do exercise today? Yeah, I I training. Okay, thank you. Give me a name, please. Give me a name. Okay. Um, Robert. Jose Alemán. Hello. Oh, he's there. Okay, okay. Here we go, Don Jose Alemán. Good evening, teacher and partner. Good evening. Okay, right here is your question, sir. Okay. Read the question and answer it, please. Lea la pregunta y responda, por favor. Hola, 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 don José. Teacher. Could you answer the question? Si ¿Sí comprendemos lo que dice. Where are you going to 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 night? Uh, okay. What is your answer? No answer for that. What are you going to do tonight? ¿Qué hará esta noche? I am, I am going to bed. I am going? I am going to bed. Uh -huh, okay. Okay, I got your message. I got your message. Don't worry about it. Okay, give me a name, please. From when was your class name? Rale me un nombre de uno de sus compañeros, por favor. Come on, Mauricio Rojas. 
Let us see Mauricio is here. Mauri, are you there? No, it's not there. Ingrid. Sí. Okay. Do you want to answer the question? Are you going to learn to do anything new? Mm. Uh, I really know. <laughs> okay, don't worry about it. Okay, you did a great job, but you can improve it too. You can do it better. Okay, todos lo hicieron muy bien, pero lo pueden hacer mejor. Why? Because if uh, if I got some question using going to, ah, uh, okay. Uh, what we are going to do? ¿Qué, ¿Qué es lo que debemos de hacer si tengo preguntas con going to? Se nos escapó, ¿cierto? Y eso ya lo vimos. Alguien me va a decir, los nervios, teacher, los nervios. Okay, but don't worry about, don't worry about. Okay, let us continue then. Okay, here we go. Let us continue with the next activity. Mm -hmm. And the next activity is this. And it said this way, listen to your teacher, read the conversation, then practice with a pattern. A phone call to a hotel. Okay, just listen, please. This conversation is between Jen and Gerardo. Hello, thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jen. How can I help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course, I'm Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gomez? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? A single room, please. Okay, just read it. And if you have any questions to follow on here, just let me know, please. I'm going to give you two minutes in order that you read it and identify all the difficult work for you. And then I'm going to read it again. Okay, let us read it. Teacher. For me, it's very difficult with the numbers. Uh, how can I say uh, uh, Friday? I'm going to arrive on Friday. 14th. And this... TH sound, uh, what you need to do is just to put your tip of your tongue between the upper and lower teeth. Para hacer ese sonido Z, eh, esto es como son ordinal numbers, eh, necesitamos uh, como poner la punta de nuestra lengua entre los dientes superiores e inferiores y hacer un sonido 
hacia afuera como que si fuese una abeja. Friday 14. 14. 14. 14. Porque son ordinal number esos. Ok, continue. Ok, teacher, sí. Ok. Okay, I'm going to read it again. Voy a leerlo una vez más. Hello, thank you for calling. Sí, claro. Hello. Se me olvidó cómo se dice en inglés, pero en realidad que es doble room. ¿Qué es? Doble cuarto. Doble habitación. Ahí, bueno, casi como lo dice ella, sería eso. Pero si lo que está buscando son camas... No, teacher, de... sería en la, en, la, en la última participación de Jen, donde dice, are you going to make the reservation for a single or okay, uh, okay. I, got, I got you, I got you. Uh, are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? Ojo con esto. Ojo con esto. No nos confundamos con esto. Porque... Cuando dice for a single is one person and for a double run is going to be for two. And, and he says single run please. We infer that when we talk about single run, uh, you are going to find out only just one bed. And when we say double room, that means that we are going to have two beds or maybe three in some times, all depend on the kind of the rest uh, of the hotel, I'm sorry. I don't know if you got my message, yes? Si me comprendió? Una habitación simple y una habitación doble, dicho. Yes. Okay. Yeah. And what I explained was uh, really simple. Lo que expliqué fue simple, pues. And that sometime in the whole room, que cuando uno eh, adquiere la, el double room, uh, we got the option to get a another pair but not in all the hotel can happen the same way generalmente lo que ellos van a sugerir es que mejor tome otra habitación porque ese es el negocio de ellos pero algunas veces eh, depende del la, el lugar y todo eso eh, le pueden asignar si es una persona que, que Solo por una, ellos le asignan una cama más pequeña. But not all the time, I told you. All depends on the, on the situation and, and the place and the kind of hotel that we are talking about. Okay. Another question? No? No question, teacher. Okay, let us practice right here. Uh, you are going to choose someone uh, in the platform and you are going to say, okay, for example, uh, what about, let me see, I'm going to look for someone here. I would like to work with Sara. Sara, are you there, Sara? Sara. Hello, Sarah. Bueno, Sarita no está. Se levantó un momentito a tomar agua, maybe. Ah, it's there, it's there. 
Okay, okay. Okay, Sara. Let us uh, let us start with the conversation. Uh, I'm going to be Gerardo, and you are going to be Jen. Okay, let us start now, please. Go ahead, Sara. Hello, thank you for calling the Golder Star Hotel. Be he Jen. How do you help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sir, may I have your name, please? Of course, I'm Max Lasso. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When are you going to arrive? I am going to arrive on Friday 14. How long are you going to stay with you, Mr. Gomez? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a singular of... Esa palabra no sé cómo se pronuncia, teacher. Double, double. Double room. A single room, please. Okay, thank you, Sarah. Okay, and, and that way you are going to do it. Uh, I mean, yes, a volunteer and he is, or she is going to choose uh, his or her partner in order to uh, practice the conversation. Me, teacher. Okay, choose someone. I want to do it, teacher. Me, teacher? Okay, okay, sorry. <laughs> Okay, hold on. Let, let us see. Um, okay, hold on a second. Okay, the first one that said me is going to choose someone else. El primero que dijo me es el que va a iniciar y va a buscar a alguien más ahí en sus compañeros. Luego seguiría Jonathan y luego Gabriela, creo, buscando su compañero. Okay, um, Gabriel. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jen. How can I help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I am Gabriela Ramirez. Thank you, Miss Ramirez. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14th. How long are you going to stay with us, Miss Ramirez? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? A single room, please. Okay, thank you. Eh, ¿lo, ¿Lo podemos cambiar, teacher, o, o solo así quedaríamos? Ah, ok. You can switch okay. it if you want. Ok. Ok. Hello, thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jane, how can I help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I'm Edwin Alcón. Thank you, Mr. Alcon. When are you going to arrive? I am going to arrive on Friday 14th. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Alcon? I'm going to stay to stay until Monday. Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? A single room, please. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, let us continue then. But first of all, uh, let me let me pronounce again. Okay, I'm going to read again. Hello, thank you for calling to Golden Star Hotel. This is Max Lasto. How can I help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. 
Juan Gabriela Ramirez. Thank you, Mr. Uh, Mrs. Ramirez. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14th. How long are you going to stay with us? Uh, Ms. Ramirez, I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? A single room, please. Okay, okay. And don't forget right here, how can I help you? Listen, how can I help you? Not in this way, help you, no, help you, help you. Okay, Jonathan, go ahead, Jonathan. Okay, teacher, uh, maybe Roxana Alvarez. Okay, let us see. Is she Hello? Wants to do it? Okay, okay, Roxana, I, Jen, and you, Gerardo? Okay, Okay, okay. Hello. Thank you, you. Thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jonathan Perez. How can I help you? Hello. I need to make a reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I am Roxana Alvarez. Thank you, Miss. Alvarez, when are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday uh, 14th. How, how long are you going to stay with you, Mr. Miss Alvarez? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make reservation for a single or double room? A single room, please. Thank you, Roxana. Thank Do you, you like me. switch room or no? Okay. Okay. Hello, thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jen. How can you? Hello, I need to make reservation. Sure, may I have your name, please? Of course, I am Jonathan Perez. Thank you, Mr. Perez. Where are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14. How long are you going to stay with Mr. Perez? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? A single room, please. Thank you, Roxana Alvarez. Thank you, Erica. You're welcome. Okay, thank you. Someone wants to do it? Uh, me teacher. Okay. Choose someone else, please. Uh, with Paola. Okay, Paola is there. Paola, Paola, Paola. Good evening. I just estoy teacher. Present. Okay. okay, go ahead. Okay. Hello. Thank you for calling the Golden. Senor. Jim, how can I help you? Hello. I need to make a reservation. Sure. May, may I have your name, please? Of course. I am Amilcar Campos. Thank you, Mr. Campos. When are you going to ar arrive? I'm going I'm going to arrive on Friday 14th. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Campos? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the the reservation for single or double or double room? 
a single Chrome, please. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Any questions so far from here? Maybe uh, an expression that you don't understand or you have some doubt, just let me know, please. No? No, teacher. No. Como in, in Spanish, teacher, please. The whole conversation? Como? Toda la conversación? Hola. No, 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 teacher. Lo, la pregunta, la, la cuestión que nos acaba de hacer. Ah, si, si tenía alguna duda referente a alguna expresión. Ah. De, de la okay. conversación. Por ejemplo, alguien podría pre preguntarse, bueno, ¿y qué, qué significa how long? Alguien podría preguntarse eso, pero al otro puede decir, bueno, no, eso es, eso significa cuánto tiempo. Y no mencionamos la palabra time ahí. How long are you going to stay with us? ¿Sí? Ok, teacher. A, a eso me refiero, que que pueden haber algunas expresiones que usted tenga dudas, entonces mejor pregunte. Y con gusto le vamos a ayudar. Eh, teacher, tal vez una duda. Este, cuando uno habla de fechas, como cuando dice on Friday 14th, es necesario siempre hacerlo con el TH. Generalmente las fechas van así. October 1st, November 2nd, porque son ordinal numbers. Ok, El, es decir, lo mejor es siempre mencionarlo de esa forma. Sí, es lo más adecuado porque son, son números ordinales, van dando un orden. Ok, ok. Pero nosotros no, 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 no lo usamos así, entonces ese es el problema. Nosotros solo vemos, eh, en la escuela vemos el orden de los grados, primero, segundo, tercero, cuarto, etcétera, etcétera. But in English it's totally different, you know? Yes, ok. okay. okay. Thank you. And, uh, y la otra en español se le explico. Cuando por ejemplo es 31, ¿qué letra tendría aquí? Para la abreviación de uh, 31st. ST. ST, ok. What about uh, 30, uh, let me see, 22nd? ND. Ah, ok, 22nd, 23rd, 23rd. RD. Ah, ok. That is what I'm telling you. Ordinal numbers. Se dan cuenta que sí saben ustedes. Sí saben. Lo que, lo que necesite es que practiquemos. Para que toda su sabiduría que ya tienes en su mente pueda usarla y hacer malabares con el idioma. Yo sé que la mayoría ya hoy me comprende todo lo que yo digo. Serán pocas las expresiones que a veces todavía se quedan dudando y dicen, ¿y qué nos quiso decir? Pero en un buen porcentaje, eh, sí ya se comprenden. Cosa que al inicio, maybe was uh, kind of difficult. Is that true or not? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher, it's true. Ah, ok. Uh, lo, lo difícil es, teacher, para, para contestarle, porque a veces, es, por, por ejemplo, a mí me pasa que, que yo me quedo, ¿Qué palabra voy a usar? Ah, okay. o, o ¿Cómo le voy a responder? Y sí. así, eso es lo... lo... Sí, Ajá, pero, y prefiero... Pero, ok, perdón. Ah, ¿Pero qué es lo que necesitamos? Necesitamos... Practicar, sí, practicar. Bueno, pero al mismo tiempo necesitamos más vocabulario en nuestra cabeza. Yes. Para cuando bueno. nos toque hacer una respuesta, 
solo ir a esa biblioteca que tenemos ahí en nuestro cerebro y decir, ah, esta palabra voy a usar, venga para acá, ¿sí? Yes. Pero si no tenemos nada en la biblioteca de nuestro cerebrito referente al idioma, entonces no podemos agarrar nada. Y como dijo el italiano, capichi. <laughs> yes, teacher. Okay. Okay, thank you. Let us continue then if anybody else uh, have any questions. Or maybe someone else wants to practice. Por ahí había una expresión que, let me see, where, where, where is it? Well, 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 let me see. Well, I, I guess it's better. I'm going to read again. La voy a leer una última vez. Y si hay alguna duda, me interfiere para detenerme ahí. Okay, say hello. Thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Shen. How can, how can I help you? Listen, how can I help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure. May I have may I have your name, please? May I have your name, please? Of course. I'm Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14th. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gomez? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? A single room, please. Okay. Yo creo que hoy sí ya lo pueden leer hasta más rápido que mí. Porque hemos hecho bastante práctica, ¿no? And at the end, uh, you are going to be able to create your own conversation based on this. So try to keep in mind, please. Okay, the, the third one, uh, the third activity. Number three is a pair word. Fill the, fill the form with the information from the conversation. Compare your answer with the partner. The Golden Star Hotel reservation form. Action, the guest, when is the check-in, when is check-out, single rule or double rule. Okay, you need to do it by yourself, everyone. Esto lo va a hacer cada uno, ahorita. I'm going to give you five minutes to do it. And as soon as we, you finish, we are going to share the information. Tan pronto usted termine y terminen sus compañeros, vamos a compartir la información to see if you did a good job of course that you are going to do it. Okay, let us do it now, please. Based on the, on the conversation is this. Question, questions? Teacher, alguien es la persona que, que lo está atendiendo. Es el agente. Ah, ok, gracias. We call it agent. Finish, teacher. Okay, just wait a little bit in order that the rest of the class can finish too. <clears throat> No me lo
Finished, teacher. Okay. I finished, teacher. Okay, thank you. Okay, let us do it now. Uh, who wants to tell me what is the action? Hello? Jen. Okay. Jen, teacher. Jen. What about the guests? Gerardo. Gomez. Gerardo. Okay, check in. Friday 14th. Friday 14th. And check out. Monday 17th. And what about single room or double room? Single room. Single room. Single room. Okay, single room, single room, okay. Thank you, let us continue. Uh, okay, number four, making a hotel reservation. At the moment that we are going to make a hotel reservation, we need to use a polite uh, language. In this case, use good life for a very polite request. Need and one are also possible, but less polite. Do you got what the these two lines uh, are saying to us? I would like okay. to make reservations. 
What about need and one? Need and one. Need and one. Okay, it's very easy to understand it. Take a look at, I'm sorry, take a look at the diagram that the arrow that I got here. Vean aquí esta flecha. I can say I want to make a reservation. See? I also can say I need to make a reservation. But it's going to be better if you say I would like to make a reservation. Entre más arriba este será más cortés. ¿Sí se comprende? Yes, yes teacher. Yes, teacher. More, more polite. Okay, yes. Okay, no question at all about this part. Teacher, maybe I want is um, mm, como golpeado, un poco más golpeado. Quiero, quiero hacer una reservación. <laughs> sí, ese sería como ya en el, en el lenguaje coloquial salvadoreño. Yeah, I could like es como me gustaría. No, ya refinado, ¿verdad? refinado. Formal teacher. Ah, ok, we can, we can say formal, pero así ahorita estamos hablando en, en, de manera coloquial. Entonces, así más fino, dice la gente. Yes. Ok, ok, perfect. I, I, I love that, that you understand my point. Lo que sí me preocupa es que, que la mayor, algunos no quieren participar. No sé por qué. Um, I don't know why. Pero no pierdo la fe ni las esperanzas. Okay, let us continue. Okay, how you be going to? Okay, look at this verse in bold and complete the sentences below. Let us see the affirmative sentence first. I'm going to arrive on Friday 14th. I'm going to stay until Monday. Miss Fuentes is going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. That is affirmative. What can you infer about that? Take a look at the affirmative word. Take a look at the structure too. Observe la estructura que llevan las afirmativas, por favor. And before to go to the negative, I would like to hear from your voice that you create at least one or two sentences in affirmative using going to, please. If you have it, just let me know. Okay, who want to start? Okay, who wants to start? I'm talking about affirmative right now. Just an example, please. Okay, teacher. Example. Okay. Um, maybe I going to visit my grandmother. Okay. Repeat um, again, please. I'm going to visit my grandmother. Okay. Okay. Okay, I'm I'm going I'm going to visit my grandmother. I'm going. I going to go shopping. Okay, I'm I'm going to go shopping. Okay. I going to go to party. Okay. I going to meet my friend. 
Okay, excellent. Okay, somebody wants to give me some example affirmative sentences, please. I'm going to sleep tonight. Okay. Uh, I'm going to go to the job tomorrow. Okay. Uh, teacher, es correcto utilizar I'm going to y después el verbo go. I'm going to go. Yes. Mm, well, in this case, yes, you can do it now. Es porque si usted se fija, generalmente siempre la estructura será going to. Porque en este caso el going se está refiriendo al futuro, no al verbo go. El verbo justamente va después de la partícula to. Ok, ok. Es solo un indicativo, un auxiliar. Ok. Ok, thank you. Ok, you're welcome, sir. Okay, someone else, someone else, uh, give me some example in affirmative, please. Me, teacher. Okay, got it. I'm going to do the dinner. Um, I'm going to the church on Saturday. I'm going to do my homework tomorrow. And I'm going to play soccer. On Friday. Okay. Me teacher. Okay, go ahead, sir. I'm going to cook an omelet on on Sunday. I'm going to sing a song. Okay. Okay, thank you. Someone else? Another next? example, teacher. I going to wash the dishes. Um, I going to to sleep better late. Okay, I'm going. I'm going to feel better tomorrow. Okay. Yes. I'm going to read a book. Ah, that's. Pretty interesting. Okay, thank you. Let us go to the next one. Negative uh, sentences. Miss Miss Puentes is not going to fly to Cuba on the 14th. Uh, Mr. Gomez is not going to arrive on Thursday 13th. Y por aquí aparece eh, una estructura que Gaby estuvo buscando en su mente cuando me respondió algo, pero no la encontró. And now we have it here. Y ella estaba queriendo decir, yo no, ¿sí? I am not going to. As you can see at the moment that you are going to create a negative sentences, what you need to do is just to add this part that is not between the beaver and going to. El not va a ir en medio de la forma del be 
y el going va a ir justamente ahí. Ok, give me some examples. Mi teacher, she is not going to play soccer tomorrow. I, I am not going to do my homework tomorrow. And I am not wash my shoes on Friday. Okay, you got three examples. Thank you. Okay, someone else, someone else, please. Alguien más, por favor. Me, teacher. Okay, thank you, sir. I am not going to travel to Italy. Okay. I am not, I am not going to, to play the guitar, to play the guitar. Okay, you are not going to play the guitar, okay. Okay, thank you, someone else, please. De los que no han participado, por favor. Tengo a Natalia, Ana, Gisela, tengo a Don José, por ahí estaba. Eh, tengo a quien más. Bueno, Mercedes la tengo de oyente. Sergio creo que ya habló, Paola habló un poco, Roxana. Eh, tengo a quien, a Héctor, está de listener. Ahí está Ingrid también. Sara, eh, no so, Cecilia. Okay, you can, all of you can participate. Just let me know, please. Okay, who wants to do it? Who wants to do it? Me, teacher? Okay, go ahead, sir. I'm not going to be late my workplace. I'm not going to watch Barbie movie. Ah, okay. You are not going to watch the Barbie movie, okay. I'm not going to cry. Are you sure that you're not going to cry? <laughs> yes, you sure. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Only that, you sure. Okay, thank you, sir. Someone else, someone else, please. Can must. Okay, let me see the time that I got. Okay, my goodness, I need to press the accelerator now. Okay, I'm going to read uh, the explanation. You should be going to class the bear, the bay farm, to describe schedule activities and activities that will definitely happen in the future. For negative sentences, insert not before going to. Y aquí le respondo al amigo que preguntó, uh, aunque ya le dimos la explicación, pero dice, use be going to plus bear. Use going to más la forma, de, la forma más del ver. Ahí está. Ok, now take a look at the, at the right side. Yes, no questions. In order to ask yes, no question, what we are going to do is just to put the B form at the beginning. In this case, are you going to stay in a smoking or a non-smoking room? Si aquí fuera ella, diría, is she going to stay? But in this case, we are saying you. Okay, are you going to make the reservation for uh, a single or a double room? And we have uh, two informa information questions. For example, how long are you going to stay? How long, ya mencioné que es cuánto tiempo. And when are you going to arrive? Cuando bien. And the explanation is this. Okay, to ask yes, no questions about schedule activities, begin with the verb B plus the subject plus going to plus the verb. For information question, just play the WH word 
phrase at the beginning of the question and continue like you would do for a yes, no questions. Okay, uh, right here we got the explanation how we are going to do in order to create questions. Just read it and let me know if you have any questions apart from here, please. Eh, ¿Cómo sería la respuesta o la respuesta común de estas preguntas yes no questions? La yes no question is very simple. Le, le, si alguien le dice, are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Yes, I am or not, I'm not. Por eso se llaman yes no questions. Con el verbo to be en presente. Una forma del be, dependiendo de, de, del pronombre. Porque si la pregunta sí, sí. es para mí directamente, are you going? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Mm, Pero si dijera, okay. is she going? Sería, si es positiva, yes, she does, but no. No, 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 I'm sorry. Mm. Ahí tendría que ser, si, si dijera, is, is she going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Yes, she is or no, she isn't. Ahí está. Nada okay, que okay. El, el, el auxiliar tú ahí. No sé por qué apareció en mi lengua. Ok, thank you. Ok, y la de information dice How long are you going to stay? Esas son de información. Significa que ya vamos a dar más amplio lo que vamos a hacer. Por eso dice To ask yes no questions about schedule activities begin with verb be plus the subject plus going to plus the verb. For information question just play the WH uh, words phrase at the beginning of the question and continue like you would do for a yes no questions okay i don't know if everything is clear here let me see the time okay uh, i'm going to move to the next slide i don't know if you have any, any questions apart from here no sé si tiene alguna pregunta Esto, este tema del día de hoy debe de quedar completamente claro en su memoria and how um, I am going to see if uh, it is clear that you are going to use it. No questions? Hello? No question, teacher. What about the rest of the class? I don't know, ma. But I would like to see to all of you with your cameras on in order to be sure that you are there in front of the computer or, or cell phone. Hello, sir. Teacher, please repeat the pronunciation. Describe schedule. schedule, schedule, schedule. Oh, okay, okay. This one, this one. About a schedule. 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 Okay. Schedule activities. Schedule activities. Schedule. Cuando habla de su horario de trabajo, usted dice, my schedule is this. I start, I begin working on say, uh, at 7 o'clock in the morning and I finish at 4.30 p.m. Yeah, and you are talking about a schedule. Okay. Okay, hey, thank you. No? Teacher, in my, in my job, I say schedule. No, no, no. No decía, no. No decía así, schedule. pero no, no conocía. Schedule. Schedule. Okay, repeat. No conocía la, la palabra, sí. Okay, repeat, Gabi, repeat. Schedule. 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 No, no le ponga una E que no tiene E. Schedule. Es que... No, schedule. No. Repeat, teacher. Schedule. Schedule. Okay, okay. Better, 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 better. Okay, let us continue. Uh -huh. Take a look at this. Take a look at this. We are going to talk about the future. 
Okay. Read the sentences, pay attention to the users going to. Okay, I need volunteer who wants to start reading. Me teacher. Okay, go ahead, Gabby. One and two. I'm going. Okay, one and two. I, I am going to eat out tonight. Okay. Mr. Mr. Goldfi is going to stay home. What are you going to do tomorrow? I am going to visit my grandmother. How are you going to get there? I am going to walk through the forest. Please be careful. Be careful, be careful. Be careful. As you can see here, we we can uh, we have different way how to use going to. For example, I'm going to eat out tonight. Uh, and we have a question, for example, Miss Wall is, is going to stay home. Uh, what are you going to do tomorrow? And so on. Okay, I'm, I'm based on my time. And I, I, I got here something. This is a schema in order that you can see it. The positive form is right here. I, I got. I am going to, and we are going to find out the infinite right here. For example, Mary is going to travel this holiday. Uh, they're going to go to a very expensive restaurant and I'm going to come home late. Okay, take a, a glance at the, uh, in a hurry, please. If you've got a question, let me know. Dele una miradita así rapidito, por favor. Y me hace pregunta de lo que no comprenda. De lo contrario, vamos hacia adelante. Porque esto es un review. Tell me. No questions. I don't have questions, teacher. Okay, teacher. Okay, let me continue then. Uh, we got the negative structure. We already talked about this too, but maybe some uh, someone can uh, have any questions related. I'm not going to go to the party. Uh, right here, we got an example, the one that somebody asked me. Aquí tenemos un ejemplo, caballero, que hizo la pregunta. Observe, I, I'm not going to go to the party. Aquí está. Es lo que le expliqué. One, is, one isn't going to work today. They are, aren't going to study at the hotel. Questions? No questions? No? Say it no, teacher. Okay. No, teacher, don't have questions. Okay, and this is the question for what... Uh, I'm not or uh, what I what I'm not going then you are going to use uh, infinity two if you want for example what are you going to do later or what is uh, she going to cook or uh, are they going to attend the meeting or where is Maria going to study you know this is in question for Okay, let me see what we have here. What, the, uh, what are they going to do? Okay, tell me. Based on the picture, what can you tell? The camping teacher. Ah, okay, but, but how is going to be the, the, the right answer? Si es una pregunta de información, ¿cómo sería la correcta? They are going to camping in ah, the okay. summer. Ok, ok. Take a look, take a look at the structure. We got it here. Mm 
they are going to go camping. Ojo con esto. They okay. are going to go camping. To camping. Son detallitos. Okay, next one. Someone, someone wants to resolve? Alguien completa, por favor? He's going to go an accident. He's going to go. Has teacher. To ah, he's mm. going to have. Has a, an accident. Okay, let us see. Let us see. Okay. Ay, no cambia la forma, ¿verdad? Cuando usa ha, going to, no cambia la forma del verbo, ¿verdad? No, porque ya no pueden haber dos inflections. Ok, here we go. Acuérdese que si ya tengo la partícula to aquí, el verbo va a ir justamente eh, el infinitivo. Yes. Ok, take a look at the picture, please. What are you going to do? Take a look. I'm going to a picture of you. Okay, who wants to complete it? I am going to take a picture of you. Okay, let, let us see, let us see. Okay, perfect. I don't know if you can hear uh, the sound as soon as I shut it. Pueden oír un sonido que tiene la presentación, no? No, teacher. No. No, teacher. Okay, hold on a second. Let me share it with uh, with sounds. Es para que no se me duerma. Okay, the next one. Next one. Okay. He's going to TV. Okay, tell me. He's going, He's going to, to watch, watch TV. TV. Okay, let me find out. Can you hear it? Yes? Yes. Yes, yes. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Let us continue then. So, um, what about this one? Yeah. Tom going to his car. Tom is going to... going to wash his car. Okay, let us see. Let us see. Wash or to clean. Both of them are correct. Okay. Tom is going to clean or wash his car. Okay, in the next one, I'm going to just put the picture and not let it, but in order that you can interrupt them in. Okay, what about that? Tell me. Ask a question, ask a question. What's, what is Be going late. to happen? He's going to late. Be late. He's going oh. to be late. Okay, tell me the question. What is going to happen? He's going to be late. Take a look. Okay. He's, He's going to arrive going to late to... for work. Oh, He's going to be late for work. For work. For work. Okay. Okay, one more. One more. Okay, tell me about this. And take a look at the picture first, and later on you can tell me. 
Go ahead. Copy the exam. Cal Calvin. Calvin is going to copy in the exam. For the exam. Oh, no. What else? Let us find out. Ah, he's going to in his English test. Tell me. He's going to copy in the English test. Dime, dime, Lord. Copy. No? Maybe he's going, reprove. he's going to reprove. No, he's going to cheat. He's going to copy in his English class. They should uh, sometimes say cheating. Hmm. El significado, teacher. Which one? About shit? Correcto. Es como hacer trampa. No, mm, okay. Don't be shit, don't be shit. No, es como que dice, no estés copiando, no estés haciendo trampa. Eso es. Okay, next. Take a look at the picture and tell me. What are you doing to do? Cookie. Okay, let us see this one. Okay, I I, I gave you. Hi. A... Okay. I this. One. I am going to make a cake. Let us see. <laughs> oh, okay, perfect. What else? Okay, take a look at the picture. What is going to happen? Happen. Okay. Going to rain. Do it out. No. Okay, somebody else? Someone else, please. Maybe a rain, teacher? Don't forget this one. It is going to... Well, I got more example, but uh, in order to finish, I would like to ask you, um, you don't need to write down anything. I need a, uh, a couple volunteer who wants to make a, a, a reservation. Okay, necesito que un, un, una pareja de ustedes haga una reservación based on um, the conversation in the previous conversation that we started. Pero ahora lo vamos a hacer así a capela sin estar eh, Viendo la conversación. Oh, okay, who wants to do it? Let us see. Who wants to do it? Volunteers, where are you? Come on, come on, you can do it. Anybody wants to do it? No. Someone else, teacher, because yesterday I made the reservation with. Okay, okay, no problem. <laughs> oh, yes, I, I got you once. No someone way. else, someone else. Yeah, 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 yeah. Tenemos, uh, we got uh, 17, eso es lo que le estoy diciendo. 
tenemos 17 personas. Cualquiera de los que no han participado puede hacerlo. La oportunidad es para todos, chicos. Recuerda, mira, entre más practico, más aprendo. Y nadie me podrá decir al final, no, es que usted le prestó más atención solamente a los que participaban. Todo el mundo le he dado la misma oportunidad. Y sus compañeros, en vista de que nadie más lo quiere hacer, ellos lo hacen. Entonces, it is time to start doing your best effort in order to develop your skills. Es hora de iniciar a desarrollar sus habilidades. Nadie quiere. Ok. Let me check out the time. And you are going to do it tomorrow at the beginning of the class. Ok, because of the time. Y como la vez anterior lo saqué tarde por... Reponer el video, pues bueno, ahorita vamos a ir sharp. Ok, America, Elizabeth, say hello if you are there, please. Ok, Carlos Amilcar. Present. Cecilia Maribel. Present, teacher. Edwin Alexis. No, no se me vaya a ir nadie, por favor, de, no, o quizá no voy a seguir pasando la lista, porque algunos se me van a retirar. Lo que quiero es simple. Ahorita que tengo a la mayoría, ojo, veamos, acá tengo en la, en, la, en la lista de notas, en el cuadro de notas, I'm sorry, que hay personas que no me han realizado ni la semana uno, ni tan siquiera el, ni el, ni el midterm exam. Entonces, yo necesito actualizar sus notas. Como dije, tan pronto terminemos y hoy terminásemos el módulo el día de mañana a las 8 mis notas están ahí me comprende entonces yo le invito por favor a todos los que no han realizado las actividades de la plataforma por favor hacerlo si hay algún problema eh, pues comuníquense conmigo rapidito y buscamos la forma de poderles ayudar Ok, teacher. Ok, thank you. Let a mí me... solo me faltan dos ejercicios que <ríe> los he estado intentando hacer y, y no me salen, la verdad. Okay, pero casualmente, son dos... casualmente no es el, el ejercicio, la tarea 17. Sí, teacher. Eh, ejercicio 3 y 4. Correcto. Solo esos dos me faltan de la última, de la okay, última sí, semana, lo, pero lo que estoy, estoy intentando bien, hacerlo. Sí, lo que estoy mirando es que eh, quizá voy a reportar esos dos ítems porque hay algo ahí para que lo revise en la parte administrativa y así poder, este, ya alguien me había comentado que creo que fue quien, quien fue, veamos. Y es que la... Hay una respuesta que acepta el, la oración completa y hay otras que solo el complemento necesita. Sí. Entonces está bien raro eso. Nada más. Bueno, vamos, sí, sí, ya, ya son dos personas. Teacher, la 17 es la que corresponde a este día, ¿verdad? Sí, precisamente. Pero como algunos iban adelantados. Teacher, a mí solo me falta la 4, que es esa, me imagino, la de la que hablan. Ah, Porque las otras sí las Logró la hacer ya... tres. Sí. Correcto. <ríe> Ah, entonces. Solo son dos de la última que están dando error. Yes. En mi caso, ¿verdad? Sí, Pero de ahí todos. todos hay, que, hay que ver todas las posibilidades, habidas y por haber. Sí, yo ya, yo ya resolví tres, pero las otras <risa> dos más me dan error. Pero okay, hay algo, hay algo, don't, hay algo. don't give up, don't give up. Keep trying, keep trying. Ok, okay teacher. No se dé por vencido. Ok, let, let me continue. Edwin, uh, Alfredo Alcón. Present teacher. Ok, Esmeralda del Rosario. Gabriela Yamilet. Gabriela Yamilet. Present teacher. Eh, Gisela Guadalupe. Present teacher. See you. 
Take okay. care. See, see you tomorrow. Take care. See you tomorrow. Okay. Hector Enrique. Present. Uh, Ingrid Geraldina. Present. Okay. Pendiente, pendiente ahí. Que me resuelva lo que falta, por favor. Jonathan. Present. Don José Ernesto. Pongámonos al día, don José Ernesto, con la semana 3. Paola. Present. Week 2 and 3, please. Please complete. Week 2 and 3. Yes, teacher. Okay. Um, Natalia, Mauricio Antonio, Mercedes, Alejandra. Good night, teacher. Present, teacher. See you tomorrow. Okay, good night, Mercedes. Present, teacher. Okay, I invite you to complete with two and three, two, please. Okay, teacher. Okay, I hope to see you there. Uh, Roxana? Present, teacher. Okay, Roxana Elizabeth? Present, teacher. Sara? Sara Alejandra? Present, teacher. Okay, with three, with three. Sarita, le falta semana three. Sergio? Present teacher. Okay. Yesenia Lisset. Yesenia is not here. Well, okay. Okay, and let me see who's number 17. Quien es numero 17? Roxana Alvarez. Okay, you got 10 minutes in order to ask any question at the end of the section. So I invite you to stay if you want. To ask questions. For the rest, thank you very much. We are so close to finish this module. So I need that all of you participate and activate your knowledge. Thank you very much and good night. Take care. Good night. See you tomorrow. Be charged tomorrow. Have a good night. Well, the person for today is not here. Ah, oh, Sarah is there, is coming, is coming again. Sarah, hello, Sarah. I was wondering why you left. Hello, Sarah. Sara, ah, I saw this in it. Maybe you are pretty busy. Sara, are you there? Hola, Sara, está ahí? No. Well, I'm going to continue explaining uh, this activity. Okay, based on the picture, I got it going to it is going to rain, ladies. Okay, what about this one? If I don't have any idea, I'm going to click right here. She is going to 
write a short story. Let us. Okay, what about the next one? Okay, they are going to let us see. Okay, we we are going to travel to Spain tomorrow. Let us see, is that correct? We are going to drive to Spain, drive to Spain because it, uh, they got their own car here. Okay, what about this one? Based on the picture, I, I am going to take a shower. Let us see. Okay. Okay. Uh, Based on the picture, what can you feel about that? Let us see. Are he going to himself? He's going to bear himself. Okay, in this picture, uh, what can you infer about? Let me see. He going to the bus. He's going to Miss the bus. Okay, let me see. He is going to meet the bus. Okay. Let us see what else do we have. Okay, take a look at the picture. What do you think? Oh, okay. I'm going to a plane. I am going to travel. Let us see. Okay, in this in this case, catch. I'm going to catch a plane. Okay, let me see what else. Okay, what about this one? Humpty Dumpty is going to, let us find out. It's going to fall, it's going to fall. And one more. What about this one? Take a look at that. He is going to every single one. He's going to break. Let us see if, if it is break. That is correct. And the last one is going to be this. Take a look at the picture. She is going to travel abroad. Let it... Okay, I hope that you understand based on the
on the examples. Okay, thank you very much, and I hope to see you tomorrow. Good night.